and now he has risen with a new ray of positivity and hope. Please welcome Vivek Oberoi. Vivek, welcome to Starry Nights. Thank you so much. Uh, do you also feel that uh, your stardom was snatched away from you even before you could really be there? Uh, you can tell yourself that uh, this happened because of that and that happened because of that. I think there's some wisdom in our ancestors who used to just make it simple by just saying, Kismat, oh. you know, destiny. <laughs> so, um, cool mind, hot coffee, smile on the face, be happy in life. <laughs> Very nice. But is there anything that saddens you? When I uh, went through a really rough patch, I mean, now things are great, mm -hmm. by the grace of God. My mom was quite worried about me. Mm -hmm. And literally, we spent the morning together and uh, all day, all, all morning, I only complained about life. But how terrible my life is. Mere saath aise ho raha hai, mere saath waise ho raha hai. Falane ne aise kiya, falane ne mujhe is picture se nikalwa diya, falane ne mujhe ye pressure dalwa diya. All these things were going on in my life at that time. And this whole politics of lobbies and everything was going on with me. And my whole focus was on that. And my mom just said, what are you doing for the rest of the day? I said, I'm doing nothing. She says, come with me. My mom for the last 30, 35 years works with uh, terminally ill patients. Exactly, exactly. She took me to meet kids at Tata Memorial Hospital at the pediatric ward. Chote chote bachche the, 11 saal ke, 12 saal ke. Aankhe lal ho gayi hain, baal gir gaye hain chemotherapy ki wajah se. Uh, panch needle is hath mein hai, panch needle us hath mein hai. Patle ho gaye hain, they're out of school, they can't play. And uh, yet when I walked into that ward, they all smiled. That they're was... fighting cancer. And I could bring a smile on their face by just walking into that ward, by just being me. 